I kind of thrive in the uncomfortable. Like I like putting myself in these uncomfortable positions and seeing how I like fend for myself out there. I sailed a lot when I was a kid. Every single holiday we would go on these like big sailing trip and so I really got sort of this introduction and love of the water from that and I also really learned how to sort of read the wind and learn about how to utilize the wind. I learned how to prone foil on a surfboard and I really enjoyed that and I was having a lot of fun. Because I had that knowledge in kite foiling and prone foiling, I was like, well, I have to try this wing foiling thing. One of the most thing, fun things for me to do in winging is just to basically try and jump as high as I can. So nice strong wind that can get my um, 25 liter board up and going is definitely my favorite, I think. I love winging in the waves. When the waves are really blown out and when there's it's not really a very good wave. It's really cool to go out and wing foil because you can still have such a blast and have a lot of fun. Olivia is uh, charging quite some waves. She was uh, really impressing, especially Henning and myself. She was uh, really showing us how it's done in the waves. She's just shredding. She goes surfing in one eye. She took a massive wave out on the reef and she's happy. She actually uh, challenged us to, to go for a backflip, you know, kind of close, you know, she showed us a couple of attempts. They were kind of impressive. I have crashed a lot of times, but I'm going to get it. I know it's in my future here soon. <laughs> Every session that I have in big waves, I'm definitely scared, but I almost thrive off of that. Like, I think that was that's part of the reason why I really want to do what I do, because I love fear, like I love that feeling. I sort of search for that, I guess, and that's why I think I'm always trying to go out in bigger and bigger waves, because I like that feeling. 